When my uh, wife passed away a year ago, I had uh, time to do something, so I just came back to town to see what was going on. I asked the mayor if I could do something, perhaps paint something that needed to be painted. We have a mural in town that needed freshening up, and so we did that, and we've done all kinds of projects. We got into painting houses. We've done uh, in the 50s now, and uh, projects throughout the town. And uh, we're gonna do uh, hopefully 17 projects today. Our local career center um, here in um, Nelsonville, Tri-County Career Center, um, shared the story that um, Jim Cotter and, and the crew were doing here. And it seemed to fit our mission of a qu high quality service project for a small community in Ohio. We have 260 students and teachers from 32 schools in Ohio today. All these places and one down, you know, and and it's it's a great it's a great help for you know to get the place looking not nice life nicer for for everybody you know. It's great to help people, and when you help people, they they give you respect, and when you give respect, you make a new friend. It's it's awesome. I love it. It's really really hot out here, but it's worth it to be able to help somebody. Coal mining was the big thing for Gloucester and most people worked in the coal mines. This had more than the country could ever use and they took it out of here uh, by the train loads and uh, then it kind of fell off and uh, now we're sort of back to uh, a little more primitive living. And, uh, but uh, good people here, it's like a big family. Small town is just like a big family. It's nice to have uh, the Skills USA uh, youngsters here helping us and everybody in Gloucester's just pleased as they can be that they're here to help us.